Simmons presses the ignition. And Rob Simmons. Use it. Oh, and then a little break from Phipps and then to Asui. Rumbling towards the try line. Fix again, provided the acceleration. Creeby stretching for what would be his fifth Premiership try in a row. He thinks he's got that. TMO's got to disprove it. Wonderful little break from Phipps. Capstick just gets himself a little bit ahead of the defensive line. And then Tuasui and Creeby. I think he makes it, but this one might give us a better look. Sound of the whistle of the referee, Hamish Mails. Creevy picks a lovely line. He's in really good try scoring form. All down by Moon. Be onside. Hoskins again, who set up this position. Won the toe hold. Well, that's gone loose and oh, it's neatly, neatly picked up by Hepatima. And it's still opening up here, and then the pass throw and the try for Rona. It's a dreamy Devon start for the Irish. Two tries. Look at that wonderful line from the prop forward, and then look how he brings it back in. One-handed offload back to Phipps, and the ruck speed here, Topsy, really gets them in behind. You thought they might have blown their opportunity, but they recycled it. needs to do it from the right place off he goes now he's going to take some short, stopping short. Irish defense was down side. quickly as it needed to be Capstick doesn't hang around with it Simmons having a stretch the onside Quite witty once more not <laughs> quite the giraffe effort that we had up at the AJ Bell these smaller steps smaller strides and all of the work done with his hands and anyone who thought that that little tweak in the new laws might blunt the Chiefs close to the line, think again. Sam Simmons, normally the benefactor on so many different occasions, he has one last dig, gets caught yep. short, oh, good, and then Will Whitty, in total contrast to the last try he scored, <laughs> gets over the line and Chiefs are up and running. Start for him today. Hendrickson again, oh, he's bowling balled his way through, and Hogs there to complete the strike job. Wonderful, wonderful trickery there. He's been so powerful, so direct, and so strong through contact. Doesn't even need to take contact. And then connects with Hogg. It's a really, really good score. to 14, London Irish, 14. Half time for Irish, Terence Hepatima is injured, so he is on, Benhard van Rensburg, recently arrived from South Africa, an equally chunky midfielder to add to the mix. Yeah, they've done very well to swirl away from the immediate defensive shot, danger, shot, and Simmons hands, just hands. short. Phipps will Get your hands off, have seven. it, might fancy a little dart nice on his own, no, he swings it wide, yes, yes. And Van Rensburg with the try. Going short, they had the penalty advantage, but look at that, and Flaherty's yep, okay, just turned mate. in tops, isn't he? And Van Rensburg profits. Yep, yep. Oh, Rogers and he lays it back beautifully, that is wonderful stuff, and then the burst for the line, and they scored another, and Ben Lode has got it. And they have got four at Sandy Park. Lovely delay there on the path by Paddy Jackson and Ben Loder finally gets himself into the game. Just in the middle of three, sir. Instead, it's to Asui. Some more heavy spade work for the Irish. White again having a look down this left hand side. Hassel Collins hairs in. What stories are being written here today by London Irish. What a tale they may well have to tell. And it's a really, really good identification of where the space is. And there's a zip. Fighting fires, still going score. No. On the inside shoulder, half break, step off the right foot to break that tackle. Irish can finish it here. Hands up, who saw that coming? Exeter 21, London Irish 33.